Seems like every day we're, we're hitting another milestone with how hard and how, how, how terrible the housing market right. looks and the rising cost of just about everything in yeah. our area. Yeah, everybody's being affected. And in the midst of foster care month, I want to shine light on how all of this is impacting those in our foster care system. WPTV News Channel 5's Danielle Seat joining us live from Place of Hope with who's feeling this the most. Mike, Ashley, good morning. Yeah, there's a plight of people that are just falling through the cracks here. It's those that are in the foster care system that unfortunately don't find their forever home. They turn 18 and they have no one and nowhere to go. It's something that's even grabbing the attention of former First Lady Melania Trump. You can see it here. She visited their facilities just this week. Now, founding CEO Charles Bender says at least 100 young adults are put in this situation every single year, and that number is just growing. Place of Hope has an affordable housing program specifically specifically to help and it's called the village of hope we're at one of their facilities right now but with rent costs on the rise mike like you mentioned this is a number of young adults just relying on this program is just growing bender says they're doing everything they can to keep homelessness out of the question and they're planning to expand their locations in boca and their new location in stewart but the ones here in palm beach county are just maxed out he says it's becoming tough to fight against a tumultuous system we expect them all of a sudden to be stable and ready to go at 18 when your average family in America doesn't do that with their own children. They don't just say, hey, buy at 18. We as a community need to do better. So if you would like to help, donations are what's going to allow them to continue to build facilities like these for these young adults. Reporting live, I'm Danielle C, WPTV News Channel 5.